for only one day a year it becomes perfectly acceptable to creatively prank people. And since that day is just around the corner, I've dedicated this video to showing you some computer pranks that you can play on your friends. A good way to get a prank message to someone without them knowing that it's you is to send them an anonymous email. There are a few websites out there that allow you to do this and the first one can be found here. To ensure anonymity, it delays sending an email for up to 12 hours. And if you want to enter a specific from email address, you can go to this website and fill in the from field with whatever email address you want. A classic April Fool's joke is the prank call, and the internet makes it easier than ever to send them. The simplest website to use for this is MyPhoneBlaster.com. Just enter in the phone number, choose or upload an MP3, and click Blast, and that's it. Yeah. They have more advanced options, that's but you have to earn credits in order to no, enable them. If you want to prank call someone outside the US or Canada, you can go to PrankDialer.com where you can earn tokens to make international prank calls. If you really want to scare someone, you can head over to the DexterHitList.com and create a fake newsreel saying that your friend is on a murderer's hit list. Just fill in your information and upload a pic of yourself or another friend and then enter in your friend's information. When you're through, you can preview the video and when you click finish, it gives you a link to a fake news site that makes it even more realistic. That's a very real possibility, yes. We subsequently discovered uh, this document on one of the bodies which we believe to be a list of victims and future targets. We strongly recommend anyone who recognizes their name on this list not to panic, but to remain vigilant at all times. Uh, yes, we believe that uh, this person may be linked to the murders. We want to know who this person is, and we want to know where they are. A good way to prank someone's computer is to change their program font colors to white. For example, on most browsers you can go to Tools and Options and find the font settings. Then you can change the color to white so that the font on the web pages blends in with the background. For example, this is what Google's homepage looks like when all the font colors are white. And this is what YouTube looks like when everything is white. You can also do this for other web browsers and Microsoft Office programs as well. This prank costs money, but it's the ultimate gag gift. If you head over to PoopSenders.com, you'll find a place where you can order animal poop online and have it shipped anonymously to the victim of your choice. You can choose from quart and gallon sizes of cow, elephant, and gorilla dung. If you really want to prank someone this April Fools, this ought to do it. If you have any more cool pranks, I'd like to hear them. Just leave them in the comments below. Be sure to check out Tinkernut.com on Facebook and Twitter. Alright, that's it for this tutorial. For more, go to Tinkernut.com.